First thing I thought would be good to start on was the four core pillars of YouTube. Freedom of opportunity, freedom of speech, freedom of information, and freedom to belong. Can you explain those to people? Because I don't think many people will know about that. And sure. I've only learned that from being a YouTube Creator Summits. Okay, great. Um, so um, we spent time thinking about what was YouTube's mission. And um, because I think it's really important to be a mission-driven company. And at YouTube, our goal is um, to give everyone a voice and to show them the world. And that's a mission that we spent time thinking about. And in that process of, of creating that mission, um, we wound up having these four freedoms that came out of all of our discussion. And the freedoms were um, freedom of information, right? The fact that anybody can watch a video and get information about pretty much anything. I just can't take this nigga serious, god damn. And so then the next one was freedom of expression, that we want to enable everyone to have a voice and to be able to communicate what's happening for them. And we've seen YouTube be able to cover so many topics that were never covered before, um, whether people are talking about um, their challenges or having a disability or having a disease or having a passion that is shared by a small set of people. So um, freedom of expression. You liar, you. I'm good at lying. <laughs> Of course, because we want to have um, all different voices representing all different points of view. That's 100% a lie. So there's no policies that say if you put certain words in the title that that will be demonetized. All right. Meaning yeah. 2019. Because I think it's um, just such a clash of freedom of, uh, of expression but then freedom to belong. Like I know yeah. so many people that have had so many negative videos made about them that they don't feel like they belong. Right. And I'm like, well, I've had this that's not the goal too. of YouTube, but then the other person should have the freedom sure. of expression. Sure. And I'd love for YouTube to say either, no freedom of expression trumps it. So you can say that about other creators or as a platform, we don't agree with that. Freedom to belong is more important to us in these scenarios. You can't do that. Mm -hmm. But because there is no answer, people are literally like printing money at the moment and YouTube is rewarding it by hating people or just making factually not even like things that if a newspaper said it about somebody, they'd be sued within like 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. But because there is no laws around it, it's literally like, a, like the Wild West plus you're just well, making money. Well, we do, we do have a harassment pol policy today. But I've, where we've drawn that line, for me, is not high enough. Am I gonna edit this out of my video for YouTube? Sure, Fuck no. Why? Why? Why would I? Why would I edit out legit criticism of YouTube for a video going on YouTube? Fuck them.